Let's take a look at our Chicopee live camera right now. Seeing all that cloud cover this morning and even a little bit of patchy fog as well. We do have a bit of a high humidity this morning and we're getting a little bit of a breeze as well as we can see on our Westfield live camera. And again, it's going to be cloudy throughout most of the day. Thankfully, we're not going to be seeing any rain. And we'll show you on our forecast focus for today, tonight, and coming up this week. Today, the rain leaves, but the clouds stay, unfortunately. You can't have one without the other. It's going to be a, it's going to be a dry day, though, and we can appreciate that after getting a lot of rain this weekend. And tonight, temperatures are getting real cool, getting down to the high 30s and low 40s. And this week, clouds are going to clear out going on later this week. We could potentially see some rain on Friday. We'll have to keep tracking that. Our 22 News Storm Team ESP Live Doppler Radar is showing us that we're getting a pretty dry day, no rain in sight. And we'll show you why in our clouds and radar. All of that mess from post-tropical cyclone Ophelia is now in the Atlantic and away from Massachusetts, thankfully giving us a very dry day. We are getting some storms in Pennsylvania moving through upstate New York. Thankfully, we're not supposed to be seeing any of those storms over here throughout this week. Our wind speeds right now sitting at a cool, at a, at a cool breeze between 5 and 10 miles an hour in most places. And as we go to our temperatures right now, we're seeing low to mid 50s, 51 in Deerfield and 54 in Southampton and going over to Berkshire County, a lot of similar temperatures as well. We're going to see 51 in Stockbridge, 49 in Lanesboro, getting some high 40s, Agalon at 51 and Palmer at 52. Dew, dew points right now are still going to be low, so not going to be too sticky of a morning sitting in the low 50s and high 40s, 49 in Greenfield, 48 in Orange and going over to Berkshire County, a lot of those mid 40s, 46 in Pittsfield and 47 in North Adams. Tracking our temperatures throughout the day, it's a bit of a cool morning as we're starting off the first week of fall. 6 a.m. temperatures are going to be in the low to mid 50s, and those aren't really going to change too much until we get to around 10 a.m. Then we can start seeing those high 50s, and going into this afternoon, we're still going to be seeing those high 50s and then getting into the low 60s in later parts of the afternoon. And this evening, those high 30s temperatures are possible. 36 to 40 is our range of lows this evening, mostly cloudy skies. Again, those clouds are not going to be bringing any rain this evening. Here's a look at our 22 News Storm Team Skycast. 5 a.m. today, we're going to see a little bit of cloud cover as we're going on throughout the morning, and we're going to just be seeing a lot of clouds. It's really all there is to talk about today at 1 p.m. today. Thankfully, no rain still as we go on throughout the day. 5 p.m., we're getting just past our high temperature of the day. Still going to be a little cloudy. We could see a slight clearing as we go into later this evening, 12 a.m. Wednesday morning. We could see a bit of a slight clearing. And then we're going into Wednesday morning, 7 a.m. A bit of a cloudy start to the day, but as we keep on going, we'll start getting that clearing around the early afternoon, around 1 p.m. We can see it's going to be quite a clear day. Maybe a little Passover of some clouds around 4 p.m., but that sun will be peaking out. Let's take a look at our 22 News Storm Team 7-day forecast. We can see going throughout this week, we have a great week, possible scattered showers on Friday. We're still going to have to keep tracking that, and you can stay updated online on on WWLP.com. Today we do have a high of 63, a bit of a cloudy day, but thankfully Wednesday and Thursday looking great. Sunny skies on both those days and temperature goes up a bit as well. High of 68 on Wednesday, going up to 70 on Thursday. The high is dropping on Friday to 67 and we are tracking some potential scattered showers. It's going to be in earlier parts of the day if there's anything at all, but this weekend's looking bright and sunny. Saturday, maybe a little bit of cloud cover again earlier in the day. High of 73, Sunday a high of 75, and getting all the way to the high 70s on Monday with a high of 77. And the lows are going to gradually be going up throughout the week. We do have a, high, a low of 39 tonight, but by the end of this week, beginning of next week, we'll start seeing lows in the low 50s. And if you want to stay up to date with all of the beautiful weather coming this week and all your latest forecasts, you can check out our website, wwlp.com, or download the free 22 News mobile app.